countryside. Nasty. Do you think so? Yeah. Bad things can happen to you out here. I remember Sherlock Holmes expressing similar sentiments. Yeah? Did you meet him? Oh, right. He wasn't real. Just because somebody isn't real, it doesn't mean you can't meet him. Sheldon Boniface, Norfolk, England, Earth. Visible 19th century by the look of the buildings. I better be careful. Careful? Why? Oh, I might be here. I visited this place on several occasions. Would that be so bad? Oh, potentially catastrophic. No such thing as coincidence. No. So I think we're playing a different game this evening. Do you know where the word ace comes from? No. From the Latin, as a usage of weight. Cheers, Professor. The French usage came to be applied to a pilot who had shot down ten enemy aircraft and, of course, as the expression to bait an ace. What does that mean? No, it means giving your opponent an initial advantage. Making yourself appear equal. Nothing to do with using an ace as bait, then. No, hey, not at all. Ah, we're here. The Black Swan. After you. Aren't these leggings a bit short? No, it's all right. Nobody will notice. Martha, what time is it? Doctor, well, we haven't seen you in years. But you always ask that question. Well, it's just past ten o'clock on Christmas Eve. Really? Is there room at the inn? We've got two rooms. Will you be needing both? Uh, yes. And I must have a word with George. Well, when he's got a free moment. George, look who's here. <laughs> Doctor from the family of doctors. How's the young lad? Oh, he's fine still, playing his cricket. I need your rooms. You have them. You're the sort of guest I like in an open house. To tell you the truth, I'll be the one that works with somebody who has a bit of book learning. That's a game of chess. Oh, of course. Ace, you've got a room at the top of the stairs. I'm off to do a bit of research. Meet you in half an hour. Okay. And no more mead. Doctor Who Revelation. Coming soon.